Hello friends, welcome back, hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this problem related to trigonometry 10th grade. Very interesting problem. We have been given that triangle in triangle ABC, AB is perpendicular to BC and BC is 56 centimeters. AB we have to find out. We have been given tan B equals to 3 by 4 and tan C equals to 5 by 12. There are couple of ways to solve this problem. We will go through both the methods. In the first method, we understand that tan B is not equal to tan C. That means, angle B and angle C are not equal. Then, obviously, BP and PC will not be equal. So, let us take 56 and try to divide that into two parts. I will write down one as X. Another will be 56 minus X. Let us say what we need to calculate AP as H. Now, let us apply the trigonometry ratios whatever we know. What is tan B? Tan B is given as 3 by 4, but from the diagram we know that is equals to AP divided by BP, which is equals to H by X and that is given to us as equal to 3 by 4. So, our first equation is h by x equals to 3 by 4 giving the relation between h and x. Let us go to the next triangle. In the next triangle that is APC triangle, we have tan c equals to opposite by adjacent that is AP divided by CP. AP is H and CP is 56 minus X and given this is equals to 5 by 12. This is our equation number 2. Now, we got two equations, two variables very easy to solve that. So, from the first equation, what is the value of H? From the first equation, H equals to 3x by 4. From the second equation, what is the value of h? That is 5 by 12 into 56 minus x. So, equating these two values, we will have 3x by 4 equals to 5 by 12 into 56 minus x. If we are able to solve this, we can calculate the value of x, then automatically we can get the value of h. So, let us simplify that. 4 will go 3 times. So, cross multiply, we will get 9x equals to 280 minus 5x. On simplification, we will have 14x equals to 280 and that will give us x equals to 20 centimeters if you are talking about all units are in centimeter. So, x is 20, then PC 56 minus x will be 36. Now, H equals to 3 by 4 into x. We know that H equals to 3x by 4. Now, that is 3 by 4 into x. x is 20. Simplify that, we will get 15 centimeter. So, answer AP equals to how much is 15 centimeter if BC is 56 centimeter. This is method number 1. Let us look at the second method how we can do. We have been given that tan B equals to 3 by 4 and tan C equals to 5 by 12. Now, what is tan B? Tan B is equal to AP by BP what is tan C? Tan C equals to AP by CP and we know BB plus C, CP equals to 56 because BC is 56. We know that BP plus CP equals to 56 centimeter. If we know the ratio of BP and CP, then we can easily find out BP value, CP value. Automatically, we can get the AP value also. Now, for that what we will do? We will take the ratios. What we have here? 3 by 4 and 
5 by 12. If you see now, AP value is not equal in both of them. So, multiply this with 5 and multiply this with 3 so that we can make the numerators equal. They will become 15 by 20 and 15 by 36. That means, if this is 15, then this is 20 and this is 36. That means, we know that BP divided by CP equals to 20 by 36. And we also know that BB plus CP is 56. So, we got BP as 20, CP as 36. Obviously, then AP will become 15. So, the height is 15. So, this is another way of doing it, doing that. If you think this is a little bit confusing, you can stick to the first method and you can finish it. This is more of competitive exam style and the first method is more of subject to and for the 10th, class, 10th grade. So, the value of AP in both the scenarios is equals to 15 centimeters. That's one interesting 10th grade trigonometry problem. I found this in one of the worksheet of the students and I thought I'll share that with you. So, if you find this example interesting and useful, please do let me know in your comment and don't forget to subscribe and share to our math channel. Thanks for your time. Bye for now. Also, we just completed 10 years in YouTube, our math channel. So, you can go to the playlist and see 10th, 11th, 12th grade. Lot of concepts are covered. We have around 1600 videos. So, just explore them and do let me know how you feel about them. Thank you.